Hey, hi everyone, this is Gail here from the WPCloneRPlugin.com. This is the most amazing um, plugin that you'll find out there to be able to uh, clone websites. Now, why would you do that? Well, if you're wanting a whole pile of AdSense sites um, because you want to make money off AdSense, then this is perfect for that. Also, if you have a site or you have a niche that's very similar, um, then you might want to clone uh, one website and uh, keep cloning it. Now, what I suggest is that you don't clone everything across, like I'm going to show you in this demonstration, but that you set up a few templates and uh, have different ones, because we know that Google does not like cookie cutter sites. So you might want to set up two or three uh, different templates, and then clone those as you set up many different kinds of websites. Let me show you how easy it is. You'll be amazed. It's so quick and easy to do. So let's just show you what we're going to do. And you'll see the site here, the child discipline site. And what we're going to do is clone the site and we're going to clone it into here, which is brand new online. You'll see there's nothing here at the moment. If I do a refresh, there is nothing here. So what we're going to do is I'm going to show you how to install the plugin because the plugin it isn't installed the normal way. You will download the plugin after you purchase it, unzip it, and then this is what you will do next. You'll go into your C panel, and then you'll go to your file manager, and you'll find the particular um, website where you want to install this plugin, and then you'll just go ahead and install it onto there. So what we're going to do is we want to install it onto the child discipline site because it's not on there at the moment. Uh, we'll show you in the plugins, it is not here. Okay, so we need to go and install it. So let me show you how to do that. Firstly, we need to go into here and we need to find the child discipline site. So we'll come down here, here it is right here. And then what we're going to do is we need to go into the WP content and that's where you'll put it guys. And then you'll go into, sorry, into the plugins directory, into the WP content. And you'll see that it is not here. It'll come right down here when it is. So we are here, now we need to upload it. So we go across here to this button which says upload. Make sure you're putting it in the right directory. And we go upload. And then it takes us to this little window. You go browse and find that one little file the easy WP cloner right there. Okay, it's not zipped, it's just one little file. Double click on it and it'll upload it very quickly for you into your uh, C panel. There it is, it's all done and complete. Now, if we whip across here to the child discipline and to the plugins, you'll find that it is not here anywhere but in here, up in the inactive file. It'll pop up there in a moment. And you'll see it right here. And so all we need to do is go activate. It's very quick and simple. This is how easy it is. I mean, it could not be simpler than that. You go to the WP, uh, Easy WP Cloner here. It'll open it up. Now, this is uh, the only part that you might f get a little tricky with. Now, what you need to do is if you have a, um, a baby account at uh, HostGator, then you need to put your cPanel, you know, the actual name of your cPanel in there first. So whatever that is, um, and in my case, it's a hosting account for you.com, and I would put forward slash cPanel in there if I wanted to go into my cPanel. So just remember it's your cPanel. It's where this is sitting because this is an add-on domain. So remember, we're putting it onto brand you online because we have nothing in here, brand you online. Okay, so we're going to pop it Sorry, where did we go to? Um, we're going to pop it into here. I'm sorry. So we're going to pop it into the brand new online. So the FTP login is just the ordinary login that you use to get into your C panel. And there's the password popped in there. So it's whatever it is when you signed up to get your hosting account. That is what you put in there. So I just put this one in. All right, and all we do is clone this blog. Now, it depends how big the blog is, and this is very large, so this one will take probably about maybe a minute to uh, maybe two minutes to clone. So I'm just going to press this, pause it, and then we'll come back to it. Okay, guys, it's all done now, and you'll see it'll look like this. There may be some changes in the plugin soon, and we'll have a little um, graphy thing that goes across here. But at the moment, this is the way it looks. And all you have to do is go view clone. All right, so you click on that, 
and it'll take us now to the um, site and here it is right here now if you don't believe me let me show you something else if we go to here a um, brand new online we'll do a refresh and it'll pop in here you'll see it right there there it is it's all done look at it it's all there every single file you it's all there so we'll come back to here now to the clone part because I want to show you something really important look up the top here and you'll see all this across here see it has a very long um, address so what we need to do now is we need to go into the back and fix that so you just go into your WP admin it'll go into the back here into the dashboard and now all we need to do is set this up and finish it off so that it's a ready set -y go alright so we're nearly in there I just forgot my password for a moment now we're in here in the back so what we've got to do now is go down here right down to the bottom to where it says settings in general so we'll go in here and just fix up that web address uh, you'll see that it's here just take out all that garbage there and this one here and go save changes and what it'll do it'll switch over and take you directly into the back of the brand new online here we go and all we have to do is put admin in there go login and we will have our brand new online we'll have the back end of it isn't that fantastic and if I click on here you'll now see that brand new online is now the child discipline site guys it's not that difficult to do and I'm sure that um, that you will love this particular plugin you'll find it at wpcloneaplugin.com that's wpcloneaplugin.com and uh, you better get it really soon and the reason is because it will be going up in price so that's wpcloneaplugin.com enjoy it have a lot of fun with it and go out there and make some sites